Ahoy mateys and welcome back to some more Atlas. We've landed on an island that's claimed by another tribe and we have to hurry to gather up enough resources to make our boat and get out of here before we have a deadly run-in with the locals. Oh, this um, island is apparently claimed. How do you know? Uh, look at your map in the Atlas. I made a discovery for Hazy Haven. You see the red dots? Well, apparently the, the anchor can't lower. Fully close all sails. Option ship. Scuttle, access ship properties. Well, we've got to get supplies here anyway. Yeah. Just stay away from that crocodile. That's I'm gonna I'm gonna beach us a little oh. bit more. Okay, stop coughing. So there is no anchor, apparently. It, no, I'm slowly dying. Oh my gosh. It's fine. The bed's off cooldown. Yeah, but I've got my stuff here. Yeah, you can corpse run. We can finally corpse run again. Oh, aloe. Oh, that'll probably be good for healing items and stuff. Uh, cilantro? Oh, yum. Okay, this should get us anchored. Uh, is there... yeah. Oh, lower anchor. Shit. Boom. Yeah, it, I did that and it didn't do anything. Because uh, the sales were still at 10%. Ah. Okay, uh, I'm going to go steal some tools off of Nits. Okay. I got, I'm finding, like, a Kai and all kinds of stuff. No, I'm taking Please his armor, stop too. stop blacking out. I mean, you can always go punch the crocodile thing. Oh, it's a giant snake. No, there's many of them. They're like hedgehog things. Okay, we need to get spears going quick. Oh, there's one of them right here. Radial or right? Male crocodile. They're crocodiles. Yeah, well... What do I, I need to make the spear? I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. <laughs> That's fine. We have a bed, so. Oh shit! I don't know spear. Limestone. Uh. I know spear. What do you need but for I'm spear? About to die. Ooh, light wood. Um. Well, I can't check just yet. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. All right, we're gonna be able to make a lot of stuff with this wood. Then there's a lot of wood on this island. We just gotta get our defenses up first. Well, thank you, Dragon Slayer, and everyone for the bits. Yes, I'll be uploading everything to YouTube, don't worry. And for YouTube, I'm also streaming. So that why, you know what... Yeah, see, there's a big anchor symbol. Cool, that's nice. How do I take all... Uh, there's an arrow button on the upper right. Radio Lairite. Ooh, interesting. What does that give us? Flint. Okay, so it's just a different variant of Flint. We've got okay. hemp, reeds are thatch, light wood is just wood. Okay, that is fantastic. Okay, I've got radio, I've got radio right, and I've got limestone. Limestone is um, stone. Rock. Yeah. I like how there's like different areas, but they still work. Yeah. I'm gonna get some wood. Strong wood. All right. So what do we need for spears? Because if I can get a couple spears, um, we can start defending. Let me see. Spears are fibers, flint, and wood. All right, so fibers probably what we're gonna be short on. At least we got some food. This is yep. the PvP server, so that's why I'm a little worried that the island is claimed in so many spots on the map. But can't really do anything about that. We need to. Uh, get what supplies we can, build a boat, and head out for other seas. I'm getting as much wood as I can right now. Okay. I have currently got <laughs> a lot of wood. 
Yeah, I know. It's so easy to get on this island. It's way better than... I don't know why they wouldn't put these trees on the starter islands. No, because it's gonna be hard. Oh, good. The birds are killing that crocodile over there, so that's good. Alright, so what do we need for... Uh, I need... Uh, hang on. I need fibers. I can give you some. I got a bunch. Uh, I'm getting some, too. Okay, let me see what I need to do to craft our dock. So we can start building the boat. Shipyard! Oh, that's all. Oh, okay, the shipyard takes 500 wood to make it. Yeah, I. I've uh, got okay, like the a boat's stack of cheap as crap. Right now. Okay. We've got a stack of 99 right now. That's good. These trees give a lot of wood. We also have an EXP buff, so any crafting and stuff we do now is going to be bigger po power than later. Because we're just discovered the island kind of a thing. Okay, if I can get more stone now, I can make this a cooking pot. Yeah, I'm getting some cilantro so we can have some uh, spicy meals. You know, get some good spices going. Salt, I'm sure. Oh no, no, salt was on the starter island. <laughs> Dude, taking a lot of that with us. <laughs> Give me a minute. Also, thank you for the bits there, Penguin. Alright, so what does aloe give us? Rushes, aloe, consumable. Huh, just straight up consumable. Oh, it's yellow. Okay, so it could use some of that. Nice! We're actually, for the first time ever, probably going to actually have full bars. Getting a lot of flint, or radiola, right? But I'm not getting a lot of limestone. Yeah, different rocks give different amounts. Yeah. There's some, like, red rocks a little farther in. I don't want to go over there just like yet until I have some spears. Well, I, I made two. Um. Alright, I've got stuff, so let me know what you need, and I'll give you the... What? I'm killing some rocks real quick. Is it wood, yeah. flint, stone? It's fibers, flint, and wood. Uh, I need more fibers. Alright, there's fiber. There's wood. And there is flint. Alright, it's right behind you. Yep. Yeah, two spears will be good to start. I just need to get a level so then I can make spears and then put another level into the shipbuilding stuff. I'm going to make as many spears as I can. So welcome everyone who's new to the stream. Um, Thank you, Toucan, for the bits. There's four. All right. That's that's good. I'm going to go kill some things nearby, get some meat going. Uh, can we build on this island? Oh, uh, you should be able to. Let's see. Campfire. I need flint. Uh, you, have to put, you have to put your um, flag down first. Do we? I think so. I was worried because I didn't want to let the tri local tribe know. Because I tried putting down a cooking pot earlier and I, uh, on the starter island and it wouldn't let me because I didn't have it claimed. Oh, that might just be higher tech stuff. I think smaller things, but I, I guess, yeah. So, all right, let me let me put a claim down. Oh, there's a dead manta ray in the water there right next to you. I oh, harvest it for stuff. Ten minutes to claim. So as long as we're in the area, it will keep claiming. Oh, hey, I got fish meat. Nice. All right, I'm going to go get some and crocodile. Okay, this crocodile has a little bit more health than I thought it did. I'm just going to keep taking down some rocks and trees. Thank you for making multiple spears. I can make more anytime. Pretty much. There we go. Crocodile complete. Ooh, and there's a snake here, too. Rattlesnakes are on the island. Be careful. Oh, that's... <laughs> no thanks. Ooh, prime animal meat. All right, so it works just like our big surprise there. <laughs> 
hey, it, I'd rather have them use assets they already have that we know work than yep. try to make stuff that's brand new. Oh, it is 100% an ARC clone. Like, it is ARC dropped into a pirate world. Like, there is no difference between it and ARC, basically, for mechanics. Skill tree is cooler. It's no engrams. Yeah. You now learn, like, large sections of things every time. Like, I don't really mind that so much. That no. it's, it's kind good. of a clone, because, like, it, um, I was just thinking, like, there was, um, uh, Bioware used, like, a specific engine for, like, Mass Effect. Not Mass Effect, no. Night Sealed Republic that got used for, like, on. a ton of other things and used a lot of the same assets. But nobody ever really complained because it worked and it was perfectly serviceable. And this feels exactly like what that is. Aha! Aloe heals you. Yeah, I've got a bunch of aloe. I've got a bunch of, um, cilantro. All right, let me start by making another storage box. Oh, more fish. Ooh, fish oil. Yeah. Nope, fibers and wood I'm short on. Well, thankfully those are in abundance. <laughs> yep, and just add that to the fire. Fibers and another piece of wood. Um, give me one more piece of wood tree, thank you. And then we'll get some fiber. Long trail. Fibers. Sweet. Akai berries. How do you pronounce aloe? Like, what's it pronounced like? Actually, I think I can make the large storage box now, can't I? Oh, yeah, that would be good. Yep, large storage box. I need 80 wood and 70 thatch. All right, easy oh. enough. Yep, plenty of room on this, this area here. <laughs> So there's strong wood and light wood. I wonder if it actually matters when you're building things what type of wood you use. I don't know. That'd be cool. Like it gives it better stats or something. Yeah. Aloe. Hmm. Interesting. I think we just were lazy in the US and cut out a syllable. Oh, the lag is beautiful. We're in a different section of the ocean. We've made it out of the starter area, and it runs fine. There's a little stutter lag every now and again, but... Mm, it still can't is... place my cooking pot down yet. Thatch and fiber. A little bit more of each. Yeah, because it's got ten minutes left on that claim. Yeah. The sooner we can do that, the sooner we can cook things. Yep, and I'll need it for being able to place down the, uh, uh, the boat. Right, that should get me that. Good idea. Um, I have the ability to make water skins. Hmm. That would be a very good idea for being out on the ocean. Yeah. Um, I think we can actually make water barrels before too I long. I can make water barrels. Ooh, there's a symbol above the, uh, flag. What does that mean? I don't know. Is there an inventory? Hmm. Not a clue. How much do I need to make a water barrel? Oh, damn it, I, I need, need six more thatch. I need keratin to make a water barrel. Okay, I've got some keratinoid stuff. How much do you need? Uh, I've got 27 so far. And I think Nitz has some more, too. I need 12. Oh, that is cheap. Yeah, 
it needs um All right, well, I'm going to build a storage container. So that way well, we have a large storage box. needs to be crafted a smithy, so I need to make a smithy. Oh, I don't have a smithy yet. I do have that. Smithy needs 65 hide. Uh, well, it's... I've got... It needs 40 fibers. I've got that. It's, it needs 5 flint. I've got way more than that. It needs 65 hide, which I only have 10. 20 metal, 125 stone, and 20 wood. Okay. Well, there is in the uh, small chest in the boat a large chest, because that makes sense. There's an elephant over there. Elephants get good hide, right? Um, how much hide do you need? Because I've got hide. Uh, I think we can do like 60. Like okay, we probably are going to need to kill that elephant then. Uh, let's go kill some of the crocodiles and some of yeah, the hostile 65. stuff first. Because, honestly, I want to leave the big creatures around so that they, uh... Let me make some spears first. Yeah, kill things for us. Keep gathering some wood while we go. Yeah, I know there's still time on the claim flag. That's why we aren't able to place it down. Okay. Um... Now, the crocodiles are a significantly enhanced threat. Like, much more dangerous than what we've been fighting before. Although, the ones over here seem to have despawned. Also nighttime, very pretty, and also bright enough that you can actually see what you're doing, which is nice. I am liking the game so far. I like it. So it's thank you, game. Eel, for the bits. Like, once we're out of the lag hell that is the starter zones, it's pretty good. Like, I feel like we'll be playing a lot more of this game. Although, whether we're going to be playing on our own servers or on public servers, we're going to have to see. Because the issue is, everything you have is just available for everyone offline. Yeah. And it takes a long time to earn anything. That's one of those reasons that, like, were I playing on my own, I'd play PvE. Yeah. Like, I want the excitement of PvP, but I want to be able to log off with at least my own personal armor and, and weapons. Like, I don't mind if my base is destroyed. I can rebuild a base, but, like, you find really good armor, cool shit, and have to regenerate all of it. It's a bit rougher. Okay. Spears, I've got six. I can't have my spears and my bow equipped at the same time. It's Makes sense. Like, I'm on my... Well, they can't be on my quick bar at the same time because they're oh. on my body. Oh, that's unfortunate. And that might yeah. be why they have that... Uh, you have to devote yourself to melee or range. That's why there's a cooldown on switching over. Yeah, so Nitz is the Beastmaster. Ooh, alright. I'm the ship's cook. <laughs> and I am currently the ship builder. The shipwright. Yep. Who is mostly just gonna probably end up just dying whenever my stats are low, so we can store up all the food for the trip. I guess you might be shipwright in combat. I don't know. <laughs> uh, I don't Maybe have any I'll combat have specialty. Combat. Successfully claim the territory. Alright, how much does it give us? See territory message. Set territory message. Leave for territory owner. Aw. Boom. Knackle nerd. A friendly port in lag-free seas. Mostly because we're not going to arm this or defend this because somebody else has already claimed the island, so. But that means we can now place down all our big stuff, Dawn. I killed a seagull. We can get some more skin and and meat. All right, I gotta fix up my hatchet. All right. This means, means I can set down my cooking pot. Make sure to keep some of all of your materials on you, though. Did we set the cooking pot on the 
on the ship, or can we do that? Uh, we're gonna make a new ship, so... Oh. Yeah. Just make sure you keep a little bit of your resources, you can repair your tools and stuff. Oh, I've got plenty of resources. Like, this was nothing to craft. Yeah. Uh, let me see what we've got, and then what it's going to take to craft our dock. So the dock requires... Uh, 560 wood, 280 How thatch, 70 stone, 170 fiber. What? How do I put it down? Uh, you probably need to put it near to the flag. I don't know how much territory we've actually claimed. Well, no, it, it's it's blue. It looks like it should go down, but I don't know what button. Oh, to click it twice. It. Uh, left mouse. Ah. Here we go. Oh, and I can make some water skins too. I need to do that. Nice, yeah. We can get water barrels and stuff like that. Water barrels would take a little bit, but. Oh yeah, territory message and stuff like that. Like, that's the thing, online, they're gonna really need some heavy moderation of these servers. Because, yeah, people will be very inappropriate with their messages, almost certainly. I think we're gonna have good enough amount of stone for a bit. I don't have any of the... Um, oh, that scared the crap out of me. Sorry. Nice beacon, though. Yeah. I don't have any of the more fancy dishes unlocked yet. I need another level for that. Hey, I found some cobalt. Oh, it's okay. Just cobalt and all that is just straight up metal, metal variant. Yeah. Yep. All right. I mean, that makes sense. All right. So, shipyard. We have 70 stone. Yeah, we have 170 stone. We need 280 thatch, 160 fibers, which we have... I have 129 stone, so we're totally good on stone. <laughs> okay, so basically we just need a ton of wood. All right. Well, let's see. How much do I have? Do we want to go grab that elephant while we still have the time? I have or we want to wait till strong morning? wood, 20 light wood. I can get more. We might want to wait until it's a little lighter because right. it's kind of dark. We do That's need to search for rock. some source of water. It is just a rock. Oh, do we have the stuff to make the water barrel now? Uh, I need a smithy first. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, like, I figure we're just gonna end up dying of dehydration for a bit before we end up getting a, uh, good water source, because it depletes the local area when you, uh, harvest it, so. But most of the green land, we should be able to get water out. Okay. Found a, I got a water source over here. I'm gonna see if I can fill up my couple water skins I have. Alright. I'm gonna keep gathering the wood. 560, that's gonna take ages. Did not fill up the water skin, I think. You know what? We're pirates. We're finally partially armed. I'm gonna go explore these uh, claimed territory bits. You need some more spears? I've got six. I've got three. That should be keeping me for front right for right now. Alright. I'm just gonna see if I can make it across the island without getting killed. I'm gonna continue collecting things. <laughs> See if the locals are friendly. That's a level 3 crocodile. I'm going to try to avoid combat if I can. Oh, do you need someone to help you fight a crocodile? No, I don't need to fight it. I'm I'm trying to find where the claim areas are. Okay, they're, they're f much farther in. So, okay, they're not even within range. This island is huge. I thought it was a lot smaller. That's good. Yeah, so we should we have like our entire little beach area to ourselves. We've got good resources here. Yep, definitely good for shipbuilding. And thank you, Penguin and Mike, for dropping the bits. We're doing good today. We're in fair waters. We've had fair winds, and now we're gonna have an actual ship. Before too long. Try need, gathering some water and just see I if I can hide. keep myself alive. Because we need 
need hide for a smithy. So you gotta play the little mini game, digging up for the water. Okay, that got me 60% of my water back. That's not too bad. Maybe we should try to make ourselves healthy. I wonder if we get combat boosts if we're full on things. We got cooked fish, and we got cooked meat, so if you need some food. Yeah, we should probably, actually what we should do is eat on an empty stomach, or stay on an empty stomach, so we my... can use the meat to heal. Oh, mine's almost, my stomach's almost kept... empty right now. Okay. And we don't want it to spoil. <laughs> true enough, true enough. Yeah, but thoughts on the game so far? It, it's pretty fun, like it's what you would expect from a pirate arc game. And fish does give you vitamin D. Nice. Oh, speaking of fish. Another thing died next to us. Fishing rod. No, craftable fishing rods. I can make those. Yay. That was one of the things that I made sure to um, choose to learn when I was back on the island. That is that great. I'm almost leveled up. Fish. Get me too. I need more thatch. There should be some in the box. Well, I can get it myself. <laughs> I need more wood anyway. Alright, it's getting closer to dawn, so... <laughs> <laughs> so then we can go take on the elephant, where we can actually see... For most of the games you guys are asking about, we just haven't had time to play it. Although Dead by Daylight is never coming back for my channel, at least not for a while. Not until we forget how bad it is and go back again. <laughs> yep. Oop, oh, I'm tired. I keep forgetting that stamina is much faster drained on this server than normal. Oh, and now I'm hungry. Alright. There's food. There's plenty of food. Huzzah. Oh, and there's even, yeah, the Akai is orange, so that's our orange vitamin. We got some yellow vitamin. That's good. And, like, the cooked food does seem to give you more per, like, thing that you eat, as opposed to, like, the tiny little bit you get from, like, berries. Yep. <sighs> I'm over-encumbered. <laughs> no, I didn't ask you to do that stuff. Yeah, I put all my points into weight, because I figured we're going to need to be building and gathering and stuff more than we're going to need to do much else. Uh, D and D, we just took a week off. Like, I, I, I don't know why everyone thinks like if it's not out one Sunday, we just stop the series. Like, it, we, it's just hard to schedule D and D group meeting things. So, all right, we're getting the wood going. I am starting to get a little overburdened, so I'm gonna go I'm, dump the wood. Yeah, you notice how slow I'm going? Oh wow! Yeah, you might want to run back and drop your stuff off because we yeah, almost got dawn. Yeah, I'm trying to. I also wanted to get some fibers so I can make a fishing rod for you. Ah, I appreciate it. It'll give us something to do while we're sailing, that's for sure. Yep. That's one of the biggest things. Like, you don't need it for, like, food or anything while you're sailing. I mean, it's probably useful, but most of it is just to keep you from dying of boredom while sailing. Elephant. Hey, elephant. Alright, that is 300 wood. I was also considering taking medicine when I level up. I mean, opening up as many trees and recipes early on as we can, probably a good idea. Guess what I just did. Hmm. Leveled up. Nice. Um, I'm going to get basic recipes. And... Unlock medicine. 
Hey, Blue Roses, 12 months. Happy one year sub anniversary. Sub anniversary. It's gonna take me a bit to get back to camp. Yeah, I'm going too slow. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. I'm gonna keep oh, chopping trees down. Oh, the elephant is pushing me, so thank you, elephant. Soon, <laughs> we shall be pushing the elephant into the cooking pot. Ah, ah, ah. Actually, no, we're gonna use axes because we need the hide. Mm -hmm. I love elephants. They're so pretty. Well, you can repair off the hotbar if you right click them. Yep. Also, it apparently yep. takes a lot less if you don't let the tool break. The combat system's still a little wonky. Like, I think they could use some better button bindings. Okay, I don't- I can't actually... yet make anything from the medicine tree, because I need another level up. But... first thing I'll be able to do is make a med kit. Alright. Are you able to move, or are you still heading back? I'm still heading back, slowly. I guess if you're over-encumbered, you might as well be- actually, is this game allow you to be more over-encumbered, or is it just that it's so light what you're picking up it doesn't matter? I don't know, I'm... Here, you know what? Just toss your, like, logs and stuff on the ground. I'll just carry it over for you. Let's see. Uh... Oh, I got a level up! Them... <laughs> More weight. I'll figure out my skills there's, in a second. There's the logs. <laughs> Let's see what I can make over here before everything in my inventory spoils. You know, as long as it's stacked, it doesn't actually spoil very quickly. Um, ooh, we're getting close. We're almost at enough wood to make the dock. Okay. I can make rosemary chicken, which needs animal meat, carrots, cooking herbs, and salt. A lot of stuff is gonna take stuff, like a lot of stuff that we need. Yeah. The easiest is just, um, uh, the hard tack, which is water and wheat or maize. But they, they do show you, like, um, what things they enhance. Okay. So a tiny little bit of water over here at this water spout if you want some done. It's only I three, can, but it, it'll help. I can also make ale, uh, berry tea, hot cocoa, and spiced rum. Nice. Everything but the... Let's see, the... The ale and the berry tea are easier, but they only have a couple things that they don't really do much. Hot cocoa and spice drum take a lot of materials. Alright, how about elephant steak? I don't know, but we can take him out. You hear that? You want, you want to fight the elephant? Yep. So if you do the scroll wheel down attack, it's a good strong stab to start off. <laughs> We are in axes. Yep. Because we need the leather more than anything else. Yep. The leather is very important right now. Ghost, I have some wishes to know how long you are going to be streaming for. I'll be streaming for a while on today. Unless he was planning streaming as well. I'm unaware of his stream schedule. Or is he wanting to join in? Because I, I want to build the boat. I want to at least get us a better boat. Okay, what else does the wood dock need? We need... 280 thatch and 160 fiber. Do we have a box back there than the one on the ship? Huh? Do we have a um, storage box? Yes. Other than the one on the ship? There, it's the one next to the flag. Okay. I'm gonna drop off some of my stuff. Alright, yep. Fiber and thatch, if you got any of that, we might actually be able to make the dock now. Ooh, that's a pretty sunrise. Although, red sky in the morning, sailor's warning. That's fibers, that's wood. Flint. Metal. Hide shirt that I accidentally made. <laughs> um, Alright, so we just need more wood, I think. 
just a little bit more. Ooh, I have. Uh, apparently, it's a very, very hot day. Thatch. Oh, that's what the freaking red sky is, and the fact that the land is glowing red. It's not just a pretty morning; it's a freaking hot day. No, they brought the weather systems over. I turned Dawn up more. All right, I'll turn her up a little bit more. Put that on. Uh, we're not planning on getting ahead of units. We're planning on getting the ship so that way we can all sail. Like, this game needs a lot of time put into it, so we're not trying to, like, you know, surpass you or anything. If you want to hop on for a bit or something and uh, record the ship construction, we can do that. Up to you. Recap what happened. We got out of the laggy sea. We landed here. We're building a boat. You are now caught up. Oh, God. That is not good on your water. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't start wasting food and stuff and just try to live with what we got. Actually, how easy it is to get water. Like, how far away? We this is to not find too a bad. Good source of, like, like we need, a like, a lake. Yeah. Yeah. Because this digging for water, it's not bad, but... And I can't fill up my water skins from those. Um, oh, you can't? Oh. Not as far as I know. It does seem like you can make quite a few little, little spring things, so it's not too bad, but... Yeah, and it's did a great job last night of just managing to survive the insanity of the lag long enough to get us out of that zone. Oh, I never put in my skill levels. Let's put in my skill levels. Um, I need, uh, let's unlock. Oh, I can just straight up, oh. Oh, okay. And it's prerequisites for two. Gives me a bonus to the sextant stuff and gives me intermediate shipwright. Yeah. All right, let's see how bad a schooner is to make. Um... Oh, I never did make the... I didn't get the spear engram because I just wasted two on shipwrights. Whoops. I can make spears. Schooner is 440 wood. Um, 640 thatch, 48 metal, and 380 fiber, but I think we have to make, like, sails and steering wheels. Actually, those aren't too bad. Uh, try to save our oil, because apparently we need oil to make buckets for some reason. Medium wood ship deck is 280. Medium wood, oh no, don't tell me we need, like, multiple planks per schooner blueprint. I don't think you can just straight up... Okay, we'll probably cla we'll craft the sloop first, and then we'll worry about the schooner later. But I think I have enough to make the dock. Yeah, two hours to cross an area that took 15 minutes. Once the lag was gone. Heat is terrible, though. Looks like we do need metal. I'm pretty sure these red rocks are going to be, like, copper or something. Nope, they're flint. They're just rock rocks. Yeah, just find any grass patch, lay down, and dig. It's not too bad to dig for stuff. I've done it. Water is depleted in this area. Ugh. That's the only issue I have with it. Like, limited water resource. Like, any island with a, like... Actually, does this island have an internal lake? It doesn't look like it. No, it doesn't look like it. Any islands with internal lakes are going to be, like, highly sought after just for the water supply. Unless there's, like, a water purifier or something we can make. 
Alright. I'm gonna take all this stuff into my inventory. There's a turtle! Put all my food in here. That's not food. That's thatch, that's thatch, that's thatch. Um, oh, I have raw meat. I'm gonna put that in. Uh, can you do anything with the raw meat if I put it in the cook pot? Oh. Yeah, it'll cook. Okay. Let me see. Can we make... No, we are still short thatch. That's what we're missing. So I will work on thatch. Wind was against me when we were in the lag area last night. Oof, that was terrible. You did a good job surviving it. Get a little bit of wood for the cooked fire. Okay, I need to eat this fish. I am currently starving. Yep, take whatever you need. There's a ton more veggies down in the uh, storage box, so if anything you can cook with them, go ahead. Since you have the cooking skill. I think a lot of... I think a lot of the stuff that you have, like... Stuff that you, um... Like, actually grow. Oh, okay. That's how our cooking was. Like, there's never anything you could do with, like, six different kinds of berries. You needed, like... Very specific crops to cook anything. You think pirates would figure out how to cook whatever is available? You'd think, but you'd be wrong. <laughs> I dumped off a bunch of resources there. If you want. I don't know if it's um, anything you can use, but was it thatch? I was a whole lot of stuff. <laughs> All right, I'll see if we got the thatch. Let me get a couple more of these trees down first. I'm wondering how much of the skill tree you can master with one person. Hey, Jellyman, thank you for the bits. Stamina, which means time to click. Oh, what are we missing for repairs? Stone and flint. All right. Stamina, trying to eat a million berries to get your stomach. Yeah, at least the heat wave seems to be gone. Right, I guess you could, yeah, you could learn a hundred and, yeah, probably a hundred skills total, but the question is, do some of the later skills take more than one point? Like, for example, in piracy, that requires one skill point. So it just requires, you know, the chains and stuff. I did get the captain nearing one. I really want to check out the extra skill tree, so I'm kind of like trying to open as many trees as I can while still getting useful things. Alright. I think... Uh, we should have enough thatch now. Sweet. Fiber, wood, stone. Oh, yeah, that was it. That was it. Wood, wood, crafting a tiny shipyard. Oh, we need more wood in the, um, in the fire. Oh, I can do that. I apparently still have enough weight and stuff on me. Problem is now we're starting to clear out this area of resources, which sucks. I was kind of hoping they'd grow back a little bit faster. Spoiler alert, don't take too much vitamin C. <laughs> oh. <laughs> World Flare. is green right now. Hmm. <laughs> Noted. Tiny shipyard is obstructed. Oh, there we are. Boom. 
One tiny shipyard. Excess inventory. Oh, it only lets me... Hold on. Pick up tiny shipyard before the timer runs out. Um... Do I need to make a larger shipyard? Did I make the wrong thing? Oh, my health's going down. That's not good. Ow! Oh, I need to make a small shipyard in order to make the sloop. The tiny one only makes the dinghy and the raft. Well, I've already made it. Although I could just shatter it for half the resources back. What does the small shipyard take? And where is even where is it even at? Wait, I can only craft the tiny. Oh crap. It's one of those things. Wait, we're gonna have to like get a um forge or, or a smithy up to make the shipyard. That's uh, well, what it is. I can get it. I can. I have a smithy I can make. I just. I'm currently in the process of dying because vitamin A and C excess. <laughs> Had a few too many berries, huh? And aloe. Mm. Like, they're almost maxed out. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm gonna put all the uh, extra resources I have into the box and see if you can make the smithy. I'm just gonna die up here. Here we go. <laughs> Ammo type saps. Oh, you need saps for the fishing. So it's exactly like Ark, except... So there's no way to get... Like, you can't... Can you fish without bait in Ark? I think you can. Um, actually, I just need to figure out what resources we need now. You just injuring yourself to death, or? No, I'm, I'm respawned. Oh, okay. So, uh, what, what, what do we need for the, uh, for smithy? The smithy? Yeah. Uh, smithy takes, um, 40 fibers, 5 flint, 65 hide, 20 metal, 125 stone, and... 20 wood. We have it all in the box. Do we? we actually, yeah, we have a lot of hide from that elephant. We're going to need to start hunting some more things, though, because the hide component's going to start getting us. Yeah. Oh. We're just going to have this nice, friendly port with ship docks that people can make all kinds of boats on because we can't made the wrong thing. Is there a foundation? Wood ceiling, wood pillar. I need more metal. How much metal do we need? Uh, five. All right, we got 42 more on the ship, so. Okay. All right, I can't boom. Reach it. There's everything. It's in the box. <laughs> oh, I'm dehydrated. I gotta go dig again. Stupid heat. Skills. Can we search? Oh, search, search craftables. Water. Oh, that's only things I know. Okay, water pipe system, water reservoir. Do we have the ability to make a floor? Water skin. Do we need a foundation? It says requires placement on floor. All right, Um, right, I'll take a look in a second. Water jar and water barrel is farming. Huh. Okay, stone floor. Okay, wood floor. Yeah, I apparently have the ability to do that. Ah, it looks weird. All right, wood or thatch. Let's just make the shitty one. 
I really miss S plus though. Yeah. Well, not much we can do about that right now. Um, sixty thatch. We are short on thatch. Um, and twenty six fiber. All right. I'll go get some thatch and fiber, and I'll be right back with the foundation for you. I don't like the combat mode. Also, thank you, Jolly Man, for the bits. And Need and Andy for dropping the bits as well. And using the hashtag charity. Okay, it looks like some things are kind of growing back a little bit near us. But, like, there's a certain tree line where there's no tree growth around our plot of land. Well. Well. <laughs> yeah. But I think there's some crocodiles and stuff all over our area, so we're gonna have to go hunting. What we probably should do is, after we make this smithy, go hunting. Yeah. Because that way, while we're gathering just resources, our bodies will heal, so we don't have to waste you know, healing and stuff at time. We really need to get medicine sometime soon. Well, I've got the skill, I just haven't been able to... Like, I can't get anything in the tree yet. Yeah. I don't believe anything is, uh... Uh, item stealer so far in the game. At least we haven't encountered anything that steals our items. in that area? How about this area? Like, I don't know if the water depletion thing is based on, like, just an AoE, or if it's each patch of green grass has its own thing. I think it's an AoE thing. You don't have to go too far before you can get more water. That's nice. Alright. Water's topped up. There's a lot more survival aspect to this than you'd expect for a pirate game. Well, yeah, but you are also, like... Oh, hopefully you feel better, in the, in the Sapphire. Waters. Always sucks having stuff drop on you when you're in bed. Alright, uh, what was I making? Floor. Um, floor. I've got the smithy made, I just need to have a floor to put it down on. Yeah, I don't expect us to have much damage to the floor, so I'm not too worried about it being cheaper. Looks nice. Looks way nicer than the arc floors. That's the level of craftsmanship that you're like, yeah, that actually is worth that many resources. Is it able to place or no? Yeah. Boom. All right, and in this smithy, um, okay. fibrous keratin metal wood. Let's see what we have here. I'm sorry. What? Oh, structures. Cliff, electric, misc, ship construction. Is there a way just to toggle the? No. All right, we can make 68 steering wheels, apparently. 57 decks. Shipyard, small. All right, it takes, god damn it. Oh, wow, that is. Why are you not reading my stuff? That is a lot. That is 840 wood just to make the shipyard. Yeah, I guess move everything in from the other place. Can we set a pin code on this thing? We cannot. Okay, I need um, one more fiber. Okay. Why does it say X47? Please tell me that's not 47 minutes to craft. Alright, so we just need a Billion wood. I can build a water barrel now. Ooh, if you can build it, build it quick because it's raining and it'll fill. Yeah. We hope. <laughs> Take any supplies you need. Yeah, I had to get uh, some more fiber. That over here by the 
Nice. Open lid. Yes, look at it fill. Drink your fill. Oh, that's awesome. Look at it go. <laughs> yeah, so that's going to be a default of a base, is just have 50,000 water barrels and just be like, open all the lids. I bet you when it gets hot out, though, if you have the lid open, it'll, it'll evaporate. Probably. Oh, we can make better tools? I think... Do I have the tool building stuff? Do I have metal I do. tools? I have the tool building. Oh, yeah, I don't have it. Yeah, if you can make me some metal tools, that'll help a ton. Let's see what I can make. I expect way too heavy into shipbuilding. That's fine. Uh, I mean, we need it, but. Metal hatchet, metal pick. Oh, yes. Should make a pair a, for you as well. Shovel. Ooh, I don't know what the shovel gets us. Just make one shovel for now, because I think the shovel might be a unique item thing. It's a weapon. I think it's for um, digging for water. Oh, see if you can. That'd be cool. That would save a lot of time and trouble. Hey, Shady Cloud, thank you for donating. And Little Ace dropping the bits. Sorry, I was a little slow on the uptake there. I was distracted by shiny new metal tools, which might mean I don't have to work nearly as hard. Oh, um, yeah, after I chop... Nice. Oh, I got potatoes. Oh, hey, you can just straight up, like, find food by digging. That's great. That's really great. All right. It seems to, one, go down a lot less uh, quickly the for the um, durability. And it does seem to gather a little bit more wood. Take a little sit down, get my stamina back. There we go. I mean, it's a great looking axe. Like, Dawn, you put some good craftsmanship into these. Like, I mean, I don't think you really needed all the flourishes and stuff, but you put that extra time in and you made some good tools. All right. And probably for some treasure. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I wonder if we'll let you, like, find treasure. Hey, There's actually a skill. Um, uh, it's advanced recipes. Um, there was some skill that gave you... It was, like, keen observation or something. I think it was in the piracy tree. Um... Knowledge of the old ones? No. Shoveler. Increases quality of quantity of resources gained when shoveling on open ground. And then there was... Eagle Eyes. Ange the range at which buried treasure beacon can be seen. So do you want to shovel too? Um, not right now. We should probably save the resources and stuff like that. But let's go kill some more things so we get some more hide. And that'll let me wrap up this episode for YouTube side. Okay. And I may have to get off soon for Apparently. Oh! Oh my gosh, there's a, there's a person attacking me! Well, they have some advanced stuff. Is that more? No, that was that was me. Great. Uh, what tribe are they from? No idea. Well, that's great. So much for our nice little island that we could upgrade our ship and stuff from. Where did they come from? Did they, did they sail up in a I raft? Just turned around and they were and they were hitting me. Okay, they must be on that. They must be part of that tribe that belonged to this island. And of course, they're unfriendly and stuff. Of course. On the plus side, they gave me a nice little pike. So now I have a pike and some spears. Also, a common climbing pick. Oh, and a common bola. Oh, apparently I can't have spears and the pike at the same yeah. time equipped. I'm gonna put my stuff uh, in inventory. 
Oh, two people inbound. Uh, move everything into the box. So at least they have to break the box. Oh, damn it, we're gonna lose everything. Well, we got some PvP we weren't expecting. Is that a tamed alligator? Please tell me that's not a fucking tamed alligator. Alright, they're all at half health. I think from the alligator. This guy had a cutlass. Well, shit. Um, we just pack up our stuff and head off to a different island in the chain. It's not letting me respawn at my at the bed. Hmm. Uh, respawn allowed. And it's timed. Ah. Ow. Oh god, I'm gonna die to this thing. Cutlass does a lot of damage, though. Damn. Oh, did you respawn twice? No, I haven't respawned at all. Oh, you have to—you have to like zoom in and click on the bed. It, I just respawned there. It wouldn't there. let me respawn. Yeah, it I just. It, it said like, you know, cool down, and it was like a timer. Crap, the alligator healed itself off my body. It's not letting me respawn. It just yeah, I, me I, back to the respawn I just thing. used it. Oh, those water spouts that from the shovel are way better. Um, oh, you respawned at the other place? Mm -mm. The, like, starter island? Hang on, I can't respawn at all. It wasn't letting me. Mm. It's just sending, it's just looping me back to the respawn screen. There it is. There's the bag. The bags are very hard to see. I got your stuff. Thank you. I'm trying to find their corpses. The alligators left us alone. A little bit of Captain Hook action going there with the alligator helping us out. Here's one. Here's one bag. Here's mine. Oh, nice. Nope, but take everything in it. We're heading off. We've gained some pikes and some cutlasses and some good booty. Let's get out before, you know, we have issues. Uh, take all the food you can. Let's just get everything back on the raft and go. Because we don't know how many hundreds of people that tribe has, but there is a lot of claim spots on this island. Pick a water barrel. Ooh, I'm encumbered. Yeah. If I can put this down, if I can put this on the, on the, on the boat, that would be good. I'm really over encumbered right now. And here you were wanting PVP. <laughs> yep, man, we got it. More fun when you're attacking other people. I've I seen trees attacked. fall down, so they're gonna be coming soon. Did you get the food? Mm -mm. Sorry, I can barely walk. Oh, my inventory's too heavy to jump. better to move that, um, 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 uh, to, to move the box onto the raft? Uh, we can't put that box on a raft. It needs a foundation to place it. Let's break the smithy, I guess. Yeah. And the floor. That sucks that we have to leave, but, um, hmm. But yeah, I don't know how big that tribe is or how many reinforcements they're going to come back with. 
But we beat them three to- we beat three of them, so... Alright, you ready? Alright, rotate sails, 90 degrees. At least we have a water barrel on the raft now. That's a plus. Yep. All right, there's three more islands in this chain that might not be claimed, so... Oh, the raft is heavy. All right, well, the raft has a level up, so let's uh, give it some additional weight capacity. Oh, the raft is overburdened by a lot. Uh, what can we afford to drop? Rocks, probably. Let's see, I've got a lot of weight on me right now. I've got, like, 349 flint right now. Drop. Oh, you gotta drop it overboard. Let's get rid of all these stone picks. Keep the metal. We don't need torches. How's Keep the, the fishing rod. Thing? I mean... We'll be able to sail, we just need the, uh, the weight taken care of. I mean, I'm gonna get rid of the coiled meat. I'm gonna get rid of the... Do you have a bow on you? One bow? Uh, I did have a bow. I do have a bow, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of their bows that I picked up from oh, them. I picked up one from them. What else do we have that's weighing us down? Is this... Oh! The water barrel. Yeah, the water barrel is very heavy. Um, can you pick it up? Like, store it? It makes me really heavy. This is so dumb that the raft has such a carry weight issue. Uh, can you empty it, or...? Okay. Oh, that's 500 pounds. Let's just- alright, let's just toss the water barrel. There we go. Now we're moving. Oh! Nope, you gotta toss the block. Damn it. <laughs> Just throw it overboard. We'll set sail for other seas so that way we can establish ourselves. That's unfortunate that we had to leave, but yeah, like there is like ten different tribe claim areas on this island. Like, it is not something we want to mess with. Should have figured the first island off the main island would probably have a lot of claim on it. Oh look, there's a raft coming into shore. Huh. It's a good thing we left, because then we would have had to deal with them as well. So yeah, our first pirate PvP encounter. We came away, I think, the victors of that, considering... Dawn, do you have the spear now? Because I've got a cutlass. Yeah, There's another a spear in the box. Them, and a metal hatchet. Yep. And a pike. Nice. Let's get some food cooking, I guess. May as well wear their clothes. So the only downside of all the different things having the same thing is they don't stack on each other. Which is unfortunate. Also, where did that raft go? Yeah, but these spears are nice. I'm glad they uh, made them for us. How, what level of skill tree is this? Um, pike, I think. Pike is basics of two-handed weapons. All right. Yes, yeah, so that's one of the advantages the larger tribes will have, is the ability to uh, craft a lot of weapons like that. It's going to be a lot of sea sailing, and the sailing is a little slow and boring. Oh, there's another person with a dock and stuff right off the bat already. Yeah, this area, I think I actually see movement over there. Yeah, it's another claimed area. That's unfortunate that we ran into some unfriendly locals immediately.
And also, thank you, Toucan. One guy steering and a bunch of sleeping passengers. Kind of. Oh, they are actively doing stuff over there. Someone swimming over here? That is somebody swimming over here. They don't look friendly because they're trying to swim in front of the ship. Oh, alright. Well, welcome back to some more Atlas. Um, the unfriendly pirates continue. I managed to kill him, but... Ow, that hurt. What goodies does he have? Nothing good. Take his metal axe and some of his veggies. Alright, you know what? New plan. Rotate sails. We're gonna head away from shore a bit so they can't swim out to us. And then we'll keep going that way. I'm catching a bit more wind now. Ugh. Everybody wants to fight. Yeah, they've got a base going up and everything. No, I don't want to go... Oh, don't turn me all the way back around. Are they shooting at me? I think they're shooting at me. That is unfortunate. Uh, so many pirates. And we don't have a proper ship to defend ourselves. We didn't even get to build a dinghy. Ah, damn. Burial at sea. We need to figure out our weight issue. I mean, we've got good supplies of wood. I don't think we... Uh, spears are just really good for weapons, though. Although, we, I guess we don't need them as much. Um, how's my armor? Armor's okay. Doesn't save us that much weight to get rid of it. Um, we're gonna be sailing into the wind if we go this way. It sucks! Oh yeah, we're just not going anywhere now. Mm. Yeah, we're just straight up into the wind this way. Right, we're getting a little bit of wind if we go this way. I like how the rotate sails has now changed the steering on the ship. Oh. He snuck up on me there. Killed him. Damn it, I don't want to be fighting these guys. All right, you know what? We're going with the wind. Because they can just keep Zerg rushing me. I don't have the health for it. Trying to talk to me, but I don't want to turn my mic on because who knows what they're going to be saying. Oh no, Dawn died! She saved my life with her sacrifice. Oh, but now I'm hurt. Damn, they can swim a long way. I 
What did Dawn have on her? Oh, she had a lot of our meat and food and... Alright, I can actually carry it all. Oh, damn it, I ate rotten food. That's not good. Someone is stealing my territory? That's fine, they can take my territory. Oh, that wasn't Dawn's inventory, that was the dead guy. Don will be able to respawn back on the ship. Big issue is we still have too much weight. I gotta get rid of it. Get rid of some of the wood. Honestly, we can find more rocks and stuff. You know, get rid of half the wood. Always find more later. Get rid of the torches. Just trying to cut down my weight any way I can to get more distance out here. Ugh. Also, thank you for the bits there, Toucan. Okay, um, I want to go that way, but the wind isn't favoring me going that way. Which really sucks. Because, yeah, this island is very full of very angry people. And health does not go up very well for eating some of these food items. I guess you don't gain health back when you're not hungry for what you're eating. We can't sail south again, because those are the starting servers, so we have to go north. I just don't want to get too close to land so they can just swim out to my ship and zerg rush me. I'd really rather not turn on my mic, because I then I'd have to go in and back to the videos and edit it out, because, you know, I've seen the people who play ARC. They're not probably friendly. I mean, these guys came over and were attacking. I think the second group might have been friendly, but the other ones were definitely aggressive. Is that another player? Is that a fish? I think it's a player trying to be sneaky. How come they can swim so far out to sea? Our stamina ran out when we were right next to the boat. Ugh. Well, that was exciting, at the very least. Okay, so our ship weight is now good. So I think I tossed enough stuff that we have full speed on our ship, which is good. We're making decent headway that way. Once we get around this island, I can turn us more into the wind and we can pick up some better uh, speed. Once again, sailing where the wind doesn't like you. Like, if we had a rowboat, this wouldn't be an issue, but we don't have the rowboat because we never could build it. Apparently it takes a very long time to claim territory, though. They still haven't claimed it. I'm going to toss all the spoiled meat we have, because I don't know if there's any 
use for it, and that's an extra pound. Got some potatoes. Ooh, we got some uh, cooked prime animal meat. Fancy. I'm gonna have a piece of that. It's like a nice, delicious ham. Wow, the wood goes through real quick in the campfire. Also, we don't need a spare campfire in my inventory, so off you go. That's six pounds we've saved. Everything helps with speed. Yeah, we can't place any more structures down on the raft. We can't place bigger storage or anything like that, so we're kind of limited on what we can really do. Put Don's bow in there. Trying to put the heaviest weight stuff or the largest stack stuff in there. So that way it's, you know, a little bit more efficient storage space. Luckily the stack sizes do go up to 100 on a lot of things, which is nice. Also, I got a lot of junk tools to get rid of. And I know that bag is there, but it'll vanish eventually. On the plus side, I can actually probably toss my armor. That's mostly broken. Put on some fresh stuff. Good to not have my armor break during combat. Anything under half, I'll just toss out for saving the weight. There we go. Huh, your little boxes float in the water. That's great. All right, we are around the tip of the island. Oh, cool, there's some fish and stuff, so we can do some fishing while we travel. Let's get some good wind going for us. Or okay wind going for us. See what the next island has in store. Atlas is currently only on PC. Uh, the raft needs repairs. Oh god, yeah. Thank you for letting me know. I do not know where our hammer is. Does Nitz have our hammer? I do not have the hammer blueprint anymore, so if Nitz doesn't have it on him... Do I have the hammer? That's the fish swimming. Oh, I can make a repair hammer. I need 18 wood. All right. Good thing I saved a little bit of wood. Just enough to keep fires and stuff going, but not enough to uh, really help with anything. Oof, takes 54 wood to repair. Um, we don't have that much wood, but let's see if it'll accept a smaller amount. not realize that raft had taken half its health and damage. At least it's repairing. Good old level 5 salty sea dog. Keeps us moving to new territory. I am on an official server. I'm liking the game quite a bit so far. Especially considering I have a better handle of PvP combat than apparently the last pirate groups that we've run across have had. <laughs> I think my only death, yeah, my only death in that PvP combat was to the alligator. Um, now the question is, do we have any blue fish meat? Uh, cooked fish? Eat that potato before it spoils. We don't have much on the way of cooked fish. 
Damn it, it keeps combining stacks and moving them because I've got it sorted by weight to help with inventory management. Can't tell if that's ocean sounds or swimmer sounds, so being a little ca careful there. So yeah, this is definitely the advantage of, oh god, there's a big claim on that island. So yeah, this is where that uh, navigating skill and stuff like that it gives you a larger ability to see on the map for the zones and stuff comes in handy. Because it uh, lets you see what areas have been claimed. Unfortunately, all I want to do is just build a bigger boat and then leave these islands, but everybody on these islands is pretty much devoted to not letting me leave. I'm gonna go see if the other side of this big island has anything, otherwise we might end up sailing out for another area. Yeah, we were trying to build a ship, but I ended up building the wrong dock because I didn't build the, uh, um smithy and the small dock, I ended up building the tiny dock, which can only build the rowboat. Only streamer is positively saying. I mean, like, once you get out of the lag, the lag is terrible. The dev team and their P or the dev team is good. The PR team and the marketing team are absolutely terrible. But, like, the game is, like, the game has potential and it's fun. That's why I'm playing it. Like, the launch was an absolute terrible experience, but... I've got so many pounds of food on me. The issue is I'm going to run out of water before I, you know, can do anything else. Yeah, it looks like people have claimed, like, pretty much everywhere. You just need a little area to go so I can gather, like, a couple thousand wood and build a new boat, and then I'm good. Yeah, I'm having quite a bit of fun. I think the issue is I don't think I can place beds on land unless I've claimed the area, which is really dangerous. Like, there's no reason to have a base because people are just going to roll up onto you from one of the other islands in the area break your base, and you're stuck back in the spawn zone, and I do not want to repeat that. That's why I got away with the raft rather than fighting them, is because I didn't want to lose our spawn point. Um, I have access to both Sloop and, uh, what's the other one called? Sloop and Schooner. The Schooner, though, like, I need a lot of help in order to build the Schooner, because I think what you have to do is... You make the boat, and then you have to craft all of these plank structures to fill in the boat. But I never got to place down a thing to see. Like, where is my shipman's thing? Alright, the raft and dinghy. The raft, I think, or the dinghy, I think you can just straight up. Oh, hello, crocodile. Um, please go away. It's good to know that you're faster than my raft. Um, rotate sail so I'm perfectly in the wind and might be able to outspeed this thing. Nope, not really. Um, okay, the raft is at least fully repaired. So yeah, when you're repairing, the repairing seems to be bugged right now, so only have a little bit of resources in your inventory and it won't take them all. There goes our chair, ow. And a lot of my health. Um, unfortunately, the bows are in the box. Unless Nitz has a bow. Mm, this is unfortunate. Bola, too heavy to entrap. All right. All right, we at least seem to be in an impasse here, so if I keep going, it's going to keep following me all the way out to sea, isn't it? Well, we got a real Captain Hook dilemma going on here. 
Maybe it'll get bored like an arc. I guess, yeah, if it can't hit me and I can't hit it, it might leave me alone after a little while. Tick tock, tick tock, you hear my heart, it sounds like the clock. <laughs> uh, Nitz is... Okay, Nitz still has some HP left, so he's not dead yet. <laughs> oh, boy. So thank you guys for the bits. Oh, 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 it got bored. Okay, we're okay. We've lost our chair, but the crocodile's at least gone. Um, there doesn't actually seem to be much claim on this side of the island, so let me go and see if I can't uh, land over here and set up for my ship dock and then get the hell off of this island. Put a bow in my inventory just in case I need range in the future. I'm going to store the oil because that is a valuable resource. Unfortunately, everything else doesn't stack. There's a nice, like, waterfall and stuff on that island there. Freaking crocodile out of nowhere. Ugh. No, Dawn didn't get lost to the crook. Dawn got killed by the uh, people boarding the ship. That wasn't the croc coming back. All right, I have I have a new appreciation for the character of Captain Hook. Yeah, so it looks like everybody landed on the nearest side of the island that could land there, and that was why everyone was over there. Um, did my fish ever cook? Yes. Gotta keep the vitals up. Like, I just didn't want that thing breaking the raft while I was, you know, the only one online. Oh yeah, it should be, yeah, the first episode of Atlas did go out right now. Alright, let me just double check. Okay, there is a claim down the beach, but there's no claim right over here. So we should be okay to land somewhat. They don't really like building on the same island anyone else was building on, but we don't really have too much option at the moment. Yeah, we're going right into the wind. This is where a robot would be handy, because we could still go into the wind, potentially. I don't know. right into the wind that way. Let's just try to get a little bit of angled wind so we at least move somewhat fast. I just want to kind of land more on this, t the tip of the island over here, rather than where the tribes have been based so that they won't feel like I'm, you know, encroaching upon their territory or anything. I was not expecting a crocodile to attack my ship, though. Alright, well, while we're waiting for the slow and inevitable appearance at shore... Anytime now, game. Can we equip the uh, fishing rod? Ammo-type saps. Um... Hmm. Okay, can we put berries on it? No, let's put the berries. Keratin? Does that count enough sap? No. So apparently we can't actually even use the fishing rod, sadly. Most unfortunate. Bed's still intact, our supply thing is still intact. Yeah, so I think I made the mistake by lighting that fire, which signaled that first group that I was here. 
That's mm. so much inventory weight on me. And we're not going anywhere. Now let's get closer to shore and then pull over again, I guess. As long as I keep the sails out of the red, I think we move. I think if we are red, we don't get any progress. So maybe if I get close to the shore, I can have the wind kind of push me up along the coast back to the corner again. I don't know. But yeah, the fact that it marks your territory on the map and you have to put things in your claim zone, like there's no real hiding. I'm going to see if I can hide a bed on the island, though. I craft a bed right now because we could use a backup bed um, 25 wood I believe we still have that yes we do All right, now let's see if we can go up the island by rotating Bed. Yeah, I expect to have a lot less people be around the farther and farther we get from the starter zone, but I should have expected a lot of people in this area. Here we go. Should start catching a little bit of wind this way, and then we'll just tack back over that way. We gotta re use some real sailing strategy. Yeah, character inventory counts as boat weight, so we can't, like, there's no, like, even bags on, just thrown on the deck. I was thinking about just using, like, throwing stuff on the deck to get a lot of, uh, storage and stuff. That was also counting as, uh, weight, unfortunately. So there's no real way to mess with that. I think this is far enough up. If I go 45 degrees over, I should get some wind. Oh, I'm glad our raft is uh, still sticking with us, though. It's a dangerous sea to be alone without a boat. My personal inventory weight is not bad. Like, I am at... Uh, 150 of 310. I put all my level ups into weight so I could carry more stuff, so it's been working out pretty nicely. Come on, just get me to shore, game. Just trying to be optimal and, you know, whatnot. I bet you with the sloop, though, I can just go wherever the hell I want. The problem is we are going to have to claim again in order to uh, place down the crafting thing. We're also going to need to get a level up, and I need to make sure I get the smithy. So I need advanced tools. There's another crocodile. I'm thinking the spear might actually work a little bit better than the cutlass. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna get my raft turned around for quick escape. drop anchor and see if I... Maybe this is the reason why no one's claimed this shoreline is there's no easy way to get up it. Okay, boat's still intact. Oh no, there's an easy way to get up on the shore over there. Alright, you know what? I'd rather have the claim area be kind of near that base. Oh, actually, we're quite a ways up the coast from that. Alright, 
see if we can get this thing parked. This thing is a pain to park. I really wish you could just craft an ore and just kind of do that. Oh, you actually have to click it. That's why I'm having issues. At least we have the rain. Ooh. Oh, hello! Oh, dear. Um... Let's just, uh, anchor at shore. Holy crap. Well, now I know what Dawn logged into. Those are getting closer. Those gonna break my raft? Um. Please, game, don't do this. Oh, thank you, game. Woo! Well, that was interesting. I wonder if that means there's somebody over on that part of the island. Because the tornadoes are still over there. Oh, good. There's a shark near our raft. Is it eating our raft? I don't think it is. I'm gonna go see. I'm gonna take a peek and see what's going on over there. Because I think they had, like, a hurricane system for if you were too many people in an area. Let's fill up those water skins. Hopefully they don't leak, like, arc ones, because I'll, I'll get dehydrated again before they... Or they'll, they'll drain before I get dehydrated again. Oh, God, these crocodiles are uh, kind of high level. I don't see a ship, but that's no indication. That crocodile saw me. Oh, God. Beds require placement on floor, so there is no way to make a secret hideout. Hmm. You know, I do have a climbing pick. it's back on the boat. Did I toss the climbing pick? I hope I didn't toss the climbing pick. I'm going to see if I can scale this wall and just build a base where people can't get up to it. There's still sea tornadoes over there. That's just uh, great. Oh, and there's a crocodile over in the water behind the raft. So yeah, this is uh, not a friendly area of the ocean. Climbing pick. It has durability, which is unfortunate because it probably has too low of durability. Is that actually made by a captain of a crew? Company, no. I'm just gonna toss that. It's almost broken anyway. Oh, hello, elephant. Um, feel free to do whatever the hell you want because. Honestly, I can't do anything about it. I could kill you, but you're actually more used to me not dead. All right. All right, the durability in the climbing pick is not actually terrible. It's pretty bad, but it's slightly better than what it was in Scorched Earth. Now, is my stamina not coming back?
It, like, goes up for a second, and then it goes back down. Like, I don't think you can actually climb. No. I'm exhausting myself, but I want to get back on the ground before I die. On the plus side, it's not 30% torpor anymore for, uh... Knocking you out. So yeah, you just literally cannot climb with low torpor. So I'm just going to get rid of that because that's just wasted weight. Or low stamina. But you know, I'll keep it. It's possibly useful for getting up a little bit. Check my map. Oh, well, there is some claim on that corner. Ugh. Downside about playing in a small tribe on this one, they can just come over and, you know, mess with you. Just to be very careful with my torpor from now on. It's a beautiful area, there's like giraffes and stuff over there. God, there's crocodiles in there, mate boosted! Why am I going so slow? Is it the torpor? Hmm. Just want to place an inland bed location so that way people can't steal my stuff. But I think that tribe might be a very large tribe that is trying to secure the island, which is unfortunate. As a backup spawn location would be ideal. I like this area. It's very, uh, this is like a very secret little area. People would be able to see it being built, so that's unfortunate, but... But maybe they wouldn't be able to find the claim flag. Apparently this is contested. Why is this contested? Somebody else in the immediate area? Or is it because my other flag was contested that we have an issue? Hmm. Well, you know what? The raft isn't too bad as long as... Oh, that was a bird. I thought that was someone swimming. I thought we had something to worry about. Damn, if only we had Nits on. I could have Nits sail the raft away from the island while I go and try and raid their base, but I guess we can't establish a backup base on the island. Oop, careful, don't take fall damage. Like, that would have been a really nice hidden area. They just want enough room to build a boat. Maybe I should head to the next island over, but that could be a ways. It takes about an hour to sail to the next one, so I don't know. What do you guys think in chat? Hmm. Just test. Does this go contested? That goes contested. So apparently there's a limit to how far the claims can go. Well, 
crap. I don't want to stay on the raft, but I don't think I can... Like, it's going to take me an hour, hour and a half to build that. Ugh. Now, I'm going to kill this elephant, because that's going to get me enough experience to level up, and then I'll at least be able to build the stuff I need in order to craft the raft stuff. <laughs> Run away, monkey. Run away. Because until the claim completes, I can't put down the crafting stuff, so... Alright, I got my level up. <sighs> the problem is the wind is not in my favor. Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna be right back for the YouTube side. So, our best bet is to go straight north. Alright. Oh, fuck! Alright, well. that fish keeps that thing busy. Oh shit! Well, that explains why it was contested. They have fire arrows. Oh no, I just want to leave. I just want to leave. Oh no. No, we're gonna have to go back. No. Can I respawn back over there? No, we're gonna have to go back to the spawn zones. Oh no, I'm dead for a minute too, because it was combat. I didn't do a bad, like, there's nothing I could have been done there. I should have been sailing off. Oh, damn it. You know, this game would be a lot of fun if it wasn't just idiots with sticks and bows fighting each other. Like, if we actually had ship-to-ship -ship combat or something like that, but... Oh, no. Why didn't I just leave? I was trying to leave. I was actively doing that. But they, like, one-shot me. Are you recording? And they broke my bed, so there is no... There is no area in order for me to respawn at. We're stuck again. I am so sorry. I feel terrible now. Unfortunately, the state of Atlas servers is absolutely terrible at the moment, and we couldn't ever reconnect for the spawn islands. We tried respawning into the PvE server. The only spot we could ever respawn was in the ice area, where you just die of starvation and freezing you to death immediately. Well, not immediately, but very quickly. So, long story short, we're going to be trying to set up a private server so we can record and enjoy the content. I don't think the PvP is really going to be ever really happen, because it's just going to be idiots hitting each other with, you know, primitive weapons. There's not going to be any big ship-to-ship -ship battles, unless you're in one of these giant super tribes. So, hopefully you guys will enjoy some Atlas as we actually get to go through the story, go through the tech tree and stuff on our own recording server. So, see you next time. Goodbye.